Saw dudes, we are back playing the Ender Roll. This is part number four. Okay, so anyway, last time we left off, we were running and shit. Looks like we've made it to our first real town. Uh, in this episode, we're gonna keep it short because the long episodes do hell on my. I thought that was a door. Does that not look like a door though? That's a that's a back door. That's something important. Anyways, the. Uh, these long episodes been killing me. I can uh, my my computer gonna fall apart on me, guys, if I continue to do long episodes. So this is the guy we're supposed to talk to. Real quick, let's uh let's level up though. We'll probably level up like three or four times. So let's go. So we push Z. We go to the Nether Realm, to the other place though, to get upgraded. Okay, so I don't really do that much fighting stuff. I don't do that much mage stuff. So this is like the rogue type. So the first one we did was Shadow of the Wind. So this all rogue disciplines are standing on it. It's boosted by 20% of your Shadow of the Wind, which lets you move more silently for a short period of time, raises your critical chance to hit. That's cool. Um, this is just tier two. I'm not gonna work worry about tier two yet. This is a suitable armor. Devious, what's this? Chance to be checked while you sneak is reduced by 15%. Prices is uh, okay. So, sneaking, this is what I like. We're gonna upgrade right here. Um, what's this? Hopefully, this is yeah, this is bow stuff right here. So, boost you 12% more damage, boost you ten, another 10% 10 more damage. Okay, that's cool. Uh, What's this? Trickster skilled hands. Okay, so I don't have enough, but I've got some more bows and I'm harder to detect. So that's good. So let's bounce back to the real world. Now, I don't know if those are actually like level up. Actually, I'll check on my hero menu. I don't know if those are actual like level ups or what, but we'll, we'll find out here in a second. What's all on my keyboard? You ever just find something like sticky on your keyboard and you're like, uh. Yeah, that's me right now. So, we are back in the real world. I am still. Uh. I'm. S I still don't have a level. Oh, I'm level 3. Okay, cool. Alright, nifty. Nifty and cat shit, as I always say. Uh, who are you? Riverville. Uh, Yarrow, I. I uh, this is about his death, isn't it? Uh, the rampage. Zombie. Look at this dude's mutton chops. Of course. What a beast. Who hasn't? Yarrow was one of us, after all. It is. terrible. Simply terrible. Uh, you want to hear an old man's opinion, though? Yes, I do. I, I That's why I'm here that something like this would happen. I almost died like Mouth seven times trying to get to you, so yes. Like that, but it's the truth. Hard to explain, really. Come on, uh, let's find somewhere to sit. Uh, it'll be easier to talk that way. <laughs> so if we were in Skyrim or something, this dude would have been like, God damn. Oh, okay. I guess I'll sit and talk to you too. Ooh, look at me, I'm a, I'm cool. Well, Yarrow, Yarrow, that's quite a subject, you know. <laughs> you were right when you said we were best friends. Our fathers knew each other for as long as I can remember. I dig the music Yarrow score. And I were getting it's into nice. trouble together, at least until his mother died. His mother died. No. Bandits killed her in broad daylight on, on Penny Road. Today these incidents are common, but not back then. The road was considered safe. Very safe. No she way, was on man. She her way to Ark, accompanied by three other women, and they were set upon at the pass. None of them survived. It's unfortunate. Yarrow was shattered. I think the worst part was how his father went downhill after his wife's death. I would too, man. The fishery decayed, and the poor guy filled his days with boozing and sleeping. That it sounds pretty dope. Forever. 
<laughs> well, that's a good question. On the one hand, he became a man, despite his age. On the other hand, something inside him woke up, so to speak. A desire to make like a more motherfucker. Ow. Old Mother Jenica noticed it and took him under her wing. He learned how to read and write and the holy so verses. Let's get on with it, old man. Father, he helped in the village as much as he could. Indeed, that's one way to look at it. It wasn't long before he was the, the jewel of the village. The striving young fisherman destined for great things. Destined for great even things, he even though he was the only only box. And then the inevitable happened. A keeper of the order came to Riverville to see the prodigy with his own eyes. Order? I don't, I'm behold, curious to see what the order is. We don't know what that is yet exactly. He also had a slumbering magical talent. Oh, the great. keeper took him away, and a few months later, since then. I've only seen him once or twice, as he rarely visited Riverville. I, I don't think he ever noticed how much that hurt me. Oh, don't be a pussy. <laughs> if one of the manufacturers makes it to Sergeant of the Guard, it's reason enough for a bard song. He must have been the first novice in centuries who was not of the sublime path. So yes, sir. It is uncommon. More than that. Oh, it's hard to explain. <gasps> I believe it was the way he was talking about his grand plan. Grand plan. He wanted to make the world a better place to become the greatest keeper since Lorem Waterblade. Underneath an anger. I don't think he was aware of it because he drew all his strength from that anger. The strength to do all this, to, to learn and to work day and night. It slumbers inside the pathless hmm. mage who believes he can master magic without the order's help. Ah, uh, so this must be. At first, it grants the, uh, power, but then one day. I don't remember what that shit's called. The arcane fever or something like that. Turning him into one of the monsters in the old songs. <sighs> I'm just an old man. What do I? Now let me go to sleep. All these memories. Thanks for yes, your help, mate. Of course. Much appreciated. Okay. Tell Jaspar Alfred's story. So. Do I have to go back? No. Okay, so this just must be like at the end of the town or something. I really don't like that I can't I don't think I can fast travel which I do not like like fast traveling in a game like this is fucking important uh, so I'm not a fan if I could find uh, let's let's just keep going about our business here Let's let's see what's in this building. I'm kind of curious. The drunken bee sounds like a bar. I, don't, I keep thinking that's a door. I would like to find some type of like general store and sell some stuff. I think that'd be nifty. So let's see. I'll just I'll just start at the top. I got as a name. Ah, here we go. This looks more like the town center. Looks like a food merchant. This guy. Uh huh. Now I just put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need and be quick about it. Dickhead. Um. So this would be a place to sell my books. Let's uh, not sell that yet. Uh, we could sell one of these. We could sell four of those. One of those. Sell a shield. Sell our protectors. Sell the leather. Uh, this one has. Mm, 
the leather boots have more armor, so we're gonna go with it. Uh, we're gonna sell it to you. Let's see, what else do I have that I can sell this fool? I have some blueprints. I don't know if I need to look at these first or not. Um, we're gonna keep this just in case. I don't know why I have the desire to keep that, but I don't have any desire for these maces. Oh, shit, I'm buying stuff. Am I buying stuff? No, I'm selling stuff. Oh man, I lost it for a second. Iron Warhammer. I don't have any desire for most of this stuff. Let's sell one of my bows. Um, okay, I'm, I'm content with that. So if we take a look at our items, we should have a lot more money. There we go, 357 gold. Okay, I, I don't feel like that's too bad, so. Let's go down here and see. Where's the castle? Let's let's go into the castle. You know, let's let's see what's going on here. This looks like it could be an inn or something. Looks rather big. Uh, oh, it's the mayor's house. Okay, that's cool. Secure chest. Looks like it's guarded by magic or something. Uh, that would probably be a bad idea to try and try and get in there. All right, can we? Oh, this is a temple. It's kind of cool how it's built into the rocks. I was kind of hoping to find like a king here or something. Maybe find some problems Walk that are place. going on in the town. Walk this guy looks important. Child. How may I? <laughs> what it is? The path is two things. For one, it is the name of who founded this country under. Uh. Yet the answer yeah, their so knowledge about it. Oh, okay. For it is not the lack of okay, I, I really don't want to listen to religious babbling, so we'll just head down to the old uh, to the old shriver, mm -hmm. and then we'll figure out what's going on from there. And then I gotta figure out if you guys know how. Let me know if there is a way to fast travel. Because if we can't fast travel, I'm going to be really, really sad. You know? Really fucking sad. I'm not going to like it. Hey, you oh. there. Yes, you. Do you want to know? Well, I found something. Something really, really. How about it? I show you what I mean, and you promise to help me in return. What do you say? Uh... Dangerous? I... I don't know. You wouldn't be as close to the village and to the guards then, would you? And I don't want Daddy and the others... I'll show you uh -huh. in a moment. But first, you have to promise to help... Awesome! Alright, let's see. Say yes. Come, follow me. Alright, I gotta save. I don't trust this kid. He sounds like a little fuck. Secrets from the can. I might start doing, like, episodes by the quest. That would be kind of cool. Hey. I like how everything has a name. Well, I guess everything did before. There's a nice cool house over there. Oh, shit. Shit, we got crabs all over the place, fam. Stupid kid. I'm gonna check this. Oh. Don't die, you asshole. I haven't. Oh, what? I missed in the slow motion thing. Oh, look at this. Badass. Badass. Bad to the bone. Uh, it's not worth very much. Please don't die, stupid kid. God damn you, why are you so annoying? I like how my arrow bounced off that thing. Look, I found this yesterday when I was searching for shells. Awesome, isn't it? For shells? Awesome! What is it, stupid bastard? Look, I found this yesterday when I was searching for shells. Awesome, is Yes, and you know what? 
If you shake it, you can hear a rattling, as if there are coins in it. All we need to do is break it open. Then we can split the loot. And I could give Daddy the money for the pointy beard man. So what do you think? I've already tried to open it. Yeah, that man from the big city, who always ah. comes after the moon turn. He wants money from the farmers. Daddy says he works for this jank or Borg or something like that. Yeah, I Landlord. Think so. He <laughs> tries to make us think everything is okay, but I'm not stupid. I'm and not stupid. This kid's a voice. This kid's voice, though. Is it this fucking chest over here? It has to be this chest over here. Unless there's like some type of. Hey, there's one of my arrows. Why are you retarded? God damn it. Is it this thing? Let's take a look at our journal. Open the rusty casket. It's over here, you dumb shit kid. Right? Yeah, what are you fucking dumb kid? Oh, that was cool. Where's the dumb shit kid now? What the fuck? Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, what's in it? Hang on. Ah, fuck it. I don't care. Uh, reload. Let's try this again. Okay, so the first time I tried this, the little kid got stuck on some rocks. And then I opened this treasure chest with a bow and arrow and I don't think that was supposed to happen either so we're gonna give it another shot look I found this yesterday when I was yes and you know okay all we so what do you think yeah that okay so it's basically yeah, the the so. landlord wants his damn money and this kid thinks treasure in here or something. Yes. Awesome. Let's see what's in there. Okay. There are hmm. Oh come on. What, what is the that? hell? I have this is the goofiest glitch. There aren't any pennies, only these weird nails and a piece of paper. Oh here, what a, a damn shame. Yourself. Read the old notice. Oh uh Got my inventory for that. Uh, old note. Day and night it stands there, sublime and proud, full of power, giving blessing in time of need on our path until we die. Um, so, does it say anything? That's kind of weird. A poem? Hmm, what if it's a riddle? That's what you grown-ups call it, don't you? What does it say exactly? A blessing in distress? That... Hmm. Oh, sugar. Why do you grown-ups always have to talk <laughs> so complicated? Maybe... Oh, he's maybe the, the father of Mithra. Maybe the talking about the shrine. The one behind our house. Quickly, you should go take a look over there. I have to go back to the farm to feed the leers, but tell me at once if you find anything. Did you hmm. look at the shrine yet? Shut up, kid. Alright, well, uh, let's just continue on this quest. This seems kind of interesting. Let's go ahead and continue with this. Oh, it's not going to tell me. Okay, so... Let's, uh... Where's the shrine? Let's find out where this kid lives. Then we'll go from there. 
But it sounds like he's the mayor's son, maybe? Did you look at the shrine yet? Dude, you are annoying the hell out of me. This just looks like a road. The shrine's gonna be back up here. I'm kinda interested in like this political Did battle thing. Dude, shut the fuck up. Holy shit. Alright, we are getting close on my time, but I, I had to cut out a part, so we're gonna run it just a little bit longer. <coughs> oh, I'm coughing. The arc! That way. Alright. So the shrine. Back here, maybe? Hello? Greetings. Aye, many and hardly any good ones. The streets are swarming with highwaymen and brigands these days. Yeah, More truth. Seen in all truth, the homie. Spent all episode running from them. What's happening to this world, I wonder? Seems everyone is eager to go at each other's throats. It's a shame. Truth, man. You are deep. You are a deep fellow, you are. Can I get in here, maybe? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Look like anything back here. He said he did have to feed the cows. But I don't know of a shrine. What? Huh? Wait. I think I know you. You work for the Order, don't you? Why are those wild mages up in the temple? Malthus, forgive my doubts, but why would the Grandmaster side with heretics? It just doesn't add up. I have no idea, mate. I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. Uh, so this seems like it's gonna be like a pretty boring episode. Um, basically we just find out some things about the world here. This guy says that there could be something behind the house. Since he's gotta mm, do his cows or whatever the fuck he's doing. So let's, uh, let's go behind his house real quick, see if there's anything there, and then win this episode. Did you look at the shrine yet? Okay, maybe like up there or something? I don't know, this this is, I assume, his house. Maybe, maybe towards the beach? I don't know if there's anything up there. This is the only thing that worries me, is I'm gonna get up here. There's not gonna be anything. Ah, there we go. Uh, what is that? Oh, it looks like, like some sort of monster. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is a grave. I don't want to dig up a grave, but... Something of Riverville. Uh, old note. It's not what I meant to click. I thought it said something about teleport to Riverville. Nice. Okay, so there's scrolls of like teleportation that's cool but also like a pain in the ass like I don't I want to just fast travel I guess that's nifty because they're probably they don't that's only valued at 10 gold so I imagine that it'll be super cheap to find these scrolls of teleportation to places I hope anyway try and get on the other side of this rock face here and see what this guy is doing over here. Some... Oh, fuck. Bandit cat. Okay. This is usually how my expeditions go. This 
so the AI has proved this is in back to back uh, back to back quest well not quest this isn't really a quest it's just me alright where are you at has proved to be rather intelligent as uh, she just ran to a rock and stuff. Ow, he got me. Execution. Oh, I missed. Oh, and he gets back up. Ooh. Got him with them four arrows. Oh, leveled up. Health, 100%. Health, I feel like, is a little bit underrated in this game. Well, not underrated, just. I just sold all my stuff, so I'm gonna take his stuff. Nice book, nice arrows. Cool shoes. Some really cool shoes, actually. Spare parts? I don't know exactly what that means. Um, so I have some kind of set of armor. Silent step of the rat catcher. Set item. One handed attacks do 3% more increased health regeneration by 6 points. Cool. Um, okay. So, my first unique item, I guess. I just got really lucky by finding her. Okay, so basically I'm behind the house. I don't see any type of shrine. Maybe back there? I don't know. I, I feel like I'm overthinking this a little bit, but at the same time I feel like... I feel like I'm not thinking hard enough about this. I'm also really close to my other objective, so I'm going to go ahead and end things here. I'll continue the quest, uh, like the main quest, uh, after I save. And then we'll continue the other part when we get back to Riverville, if we have to go through there or something. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope the quality is increasing. really appreciate anyone who's sticking around to watch. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.